Hi, good afternoon YouTube. Welcome back to Cerulean Creed. And today we're gonna to be discussing why I believe you should date someone with an OnlyFans. Let's go ahead and get started. Alrighty guys, so here's a little backstory. Um, the other day I was having a conversation with a group of friends. There was two girls and there was two guys. And we're discussing all about different things, life endeavors, about what we want to accomplish and everything else. I don't know how the topic came up to this, but they started talking about people with OnlyFans. They started saying that people with OnlyFans were not intelligent. People with OnlyFans lacked morals and values. People with OnlyFans were dumb for putting themselves online. And the big kicker that I'll never date anyone with an OnlyFans. When I heard that line, I was like, what? Let me tell you something. People with OnlyFans are intelligent. They literally created an audience. Like, you don't do that overnight. It takes time. And they invested that time. They were able to see the trends. They were able to see what their audience wanted. And they provided the service for it. Beautiful. Now they're getting paid for it. I'm pretty sure on social media or maybe on TikTok, you can see how some of these girls have already bought their own cars, bought their houses, uh, paid for their parents' medical expenses, um, put their siblings through college. Like, is that not genius? See, the reason why people don't wanna date someone with an OnlyFans is because of the social stigma for it. The people with an OnlyFans are the ones who are thinking outside of the box. These are the people who have realized that there's more to life than sitting behind a desk. There's more to life than being ordered around. There's more to life than being yelled at. And if none of you guys can see that, yes, I'm looking at each and every one of you. Yes, the two girls and yes, the two guys that I talked to. Like, you're not thinking clearly. Like, think. You're basically raised your entire life to be a part of the machine. You have to specialize on one skill and one skill only, and you have to do it for 40 hours a week for the rest of your life. Isn't that sad? Like we literally have money, but we don't have time. We either have time or we have no money. A lot of people seem to forget that money does not equal happiness, but money does equal opportunity. Opportunities to invest, opportunities to plan ahead, and then gives you opportunities to create safety nets in case something goes wrong. Now, take that into consideration what the outliers do, what true businessmen and women do. They think outside the box. They no longer want to be part of that machine, and they find ways to escape it. How can you break that cycle? How can you break that rat race? Well, you create passive income. And that's what some of these girls and men have done on OnlyFans. How is that not admirable? Like how can you literally be there and sit there and talk so much stuff about these individuals when they're living better lives than you? Like, so let me go ahead and summarize for you guys why you should consider dating someone with an OnlyFans. And number one, they have creative control. They have the freedom to do whatever they want. They can express themselves to whatever music they choose. They can go ahead and <laughs> create content, dress up, go to different environments and see the world to amplify their content. They have creative control. And being creative, just like every artist in our lifetime, the one thing that they've always said is that being able to be creative means you're being able to live. Number two, money. Yes, an OnlyFans helps you get more money. It's a vehicle of opportunities. You get to make money while you sleep, money while you work your normal job, money that allows you to invest in your home, invest into a car, invest into stocks, invest into retirement, invest in your family, invest in your siblings' college career, invest in something else. And uh, number three, time. And OnlyFans allows you to buy back your time. You're not stuck in the office or crunching some numbers or getting yelled at or being expected to deliver something. I'm not hating on those jobs. Those are jobs that are necessary to make the world work. But can you really spend time with your family? Can you really have time to learn other skills? Imagine only working two days out of the week, generating enough content for the rest of the week. and 
those other days you get to focus on yourself focus on your family focus on your friends focus on charity yeah i said charity there's a lot of people out there who give back so they asked me would you be able to date someone with an only fans i would love to date a girl with an only fans shit i would like to be like a stay-at-home dad i would learn how to edit i would learn how to take photography classes and i would do everything in my power to help her provide content imagine teaming up with someone and creating content so you can go ahead and enjoy the rest of your life i would love to be part of the journey to be creative I would love to be part of the journey to make some additional income. I would love to be part of the journey to buy back some time for myself so I could go ahead and do all the other wonderful things I never had the opportunity to do. People with OnlyFans are out traveling the world for weeks on end, for months, and you and me are here stuck, not generating extra income to escape the rat race. So before you go and badmouth anybody with an OnlyFans, just you should be bad mouthing yourself for not thinking outside the box yeah i understand you don't want to be showing your body online i understand you don't want to be doing it so your family can talk behind your back you don't have to but the one thing you're not going to do is disrespect someone for hustling Alrighty, guys well i hope you enjoyed this informational video and if you disagree with me, tell me why in the comments below. But if you don't disagree with me, is OnlyFans a great thing? And would you like to do it? Would you like to contribute to your significant other's success? Because, you know, if you really do love them, it's your success too. Just think outside the box. There's no reason not to. All right, guys, that's going to wrap up today's video. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Cerulean Creed, out.